This review will cover a mysterious phone call made to the Art Bell radio show. Uh, the phone call dealt with uh, Area 51 and the alien issue. We talked about uh, alien infiltration, uh, the military, how population centers uh, might be uh, eliminated or wiped out. And in the middle of the phone call, the, the connection, uh, the satellite connection was lost. Then a backup system came on. And it's quite a phone call here. Now I'll get it on the screen here in just a moment here. Let me get it on the screen. And one moment, please. And... And if you read the fine print there, if I get that on there, and and the phone call will come on in, in just a second there. You're on the air. Hello. Hello, Art. Yes. Hi. Um, I, I, I don't have a whole lot of uh, time. Um, well, look, let's yeah. begin by finding out whether you're using this line properly or not. Uh, Area 51. Yeah, um, sorry. Were you an employee or are you now? Uh, I, a former employee. Former um, employee. I, I, I was let go on a medical discharge about a week ago. And... And... <laughs> I, I've kind of been running a, across the country. Um, oh man, I don't know where to start. They're uh, they're, they're going to um, they'll triangulate on this position really, really soon. So um, you can't spend a lot of time on the phone, so give us something quick. Okay. Um. Um. Okay. What well, what we're thinking of as as aliens are there. Uh, they're, they're extra dimensional beings that an earlier precursor of the, um, space program made contact with, uh, they, they are not what they claim to be, uh, they have infiltrated a lot of, uh, uh a lot of aspects of, of, of the military establishment, particularly the Area 51, uh, the, the disasters that are coming, they, the, the military, I'm sorry, the, the government knows about them, and there's a lot of safe areas in this world that they could begin moving the population to now are but they're not doing they're not doing anything they are not they want the major population centers wiped out so that the, the few that are left will be more easily controllable discharge <laughs> In some way, something knocked us off the air, and we're on a backup system now. It's a government, or... I don't know. It has to be something, though. 
Well, did you hear? Now, you tell me because you were listening. That was awful strange. There was a really weird guy on the air when it went off? Yeah. Real weird out. Like uh, going sort of sort of sounding paranoid. Yeah. Like crying and everything. Yeah. 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 And how far into the conversation was it when, when it went off? And just a couple, about 15, 20 seconds, I'd say. Oh, you, oh my you guys missed the, you, were, you really missed a call then, and I've got a feeling somebody didn't want you to hear it. Yeah. Because <laughs> um, it was really strange all of a sudden I'm hearing Mark Furman when I went out. Right. Well, the network, the network, of course, went immediately to a backup tape while we tried to figure out what blew up here. Uh huh. So that's. And that's a quick review, and um, if you read the print there, that helped define the situation. The call uh, obviously was. Um, uh, dramatic, and it was knocked off the air, then the backup system kicked in. Um, now, when this call first uh, originated, it, uh, to a degree, became uh, somewhat viral as people listened to it, but the per person who actually made the phone call has since come forward, and this phone call is was a prank. The person had no connection um, to, this, to Area 51 or anything, and uh, just... Um, I wanted to clear this up or anything like that, but uh, if you've heard about this case before, or if you've not, hopefully this is a quick flashback. If not, hopefully I was able to get everything in here real quick. But as I stated earlier, this phone call was a prank, and uh, that should do it. Hopefully everything uploaded, and it, to a degree it largely defined itself there with its print and stuff.